It's been five years since Elon Musk first showed off Tesla's solar roof tiles. You want to call your neighbors over and say, check out, check out the sweet roof. Um. <laughs> Yet five years later, they are far from mainstream. Unlike Tesla's other offering of large solar panels, these tiles are made to look like normal roofing shingles that generate electricity for your home. Getting into the business of making them was controversial. Tesla shareholders sued Musk for buying the solar panel company founded by his cousins, SolarCity, for $2.6 billion, alleging it amounted to a bailout for his family. He was also the largest shareholder, so Musk bet big on these tiles. But their deployment has fallen from the highs of 2017, although it appears to be picking up recently. Tesla notes 2021 saw a 68% increase in megawatts deployed year over year. Although Tesla claimed it could manufacture 1,000 solar tile roofs a week, Bloomberg reported that the company could barely manage 200 weekly installs. I've reached out to Tesla for the latest figures, but I haven't heard back. Turns out it's been much harder to install the roofs than Tesla imagined. We are choked at the installation point. We'd, we basically made some significant mistakes in, in, in assessing the difficulty of certain roofs. The complexity of roofs varies dramatically. So you just can't have a one-size-fits-all situation. Tesla installs some roofs itself, and at other times relies on third-party installers. So the big thing with Tesla Solar Roof is the complexity factor. CJ McConaughey is the owner of Three Tree Roofing, a certified Tesla roof installer in the Seattle area. The plans that we get, that we design for the roof, uh, it looks like a Lego kit. Just like a Lego set, all the pieces have to fit together perfectly. The wiring is also very complex. Because this isn't something that we deal with uh, with any other kind of roof. Dealing with the tiles, handling them because it is glass, uh, they're also pretty slippery. Um, there's just a lot more moving pieces to this type of roofing than in a traditional roof. So if a traditional roof like the one most people have takes, for example, three days to install, how much longer would it take to install a Tesla solar roof? Well, that's a great question. Um, if it's a you know moderate to easy roof design, the Tesla solar roof is going to be more like the 10 to 12 days. Given the unforeseen complexities, Tesla hiked the prices of its roofs, which really upset customers, and got slapped with a class action lawsuit in California last year, led by a customer who said his contract increased from 71000 to a whopping 146000 Tesla then told customers' attorneys that it would reverse the hike for those who had already signed contracts. So how much could you expect to pay for one of these roofs right now? That depends on many factors, where you live, the size of your home, its age. As an example, Tesla's order page shows a 2,000 square foot home in Las Vegas with an average electricity bill of $135 a month is estimated to cost $57,300 before the federal tax credit. Tesla notes the price can vary up to $12,000, depending on complexity. To try to entice more people to choose their roofs, Tesla recently announced a 20-year loan option so customers can pay for their system over time. A big reason Tesla hasn't done more to boost its solar business is because its primary focus is on mass-producing electric cars. Tesla went through hell in 2018, trying to churn out its most affordable car yet, the Model 3. So it was all hands on deck to crank out as many cars as possible, and solar took a back seat. We have to basically take the whole company including flash people that work, were on solar uh, and have more on cars. Not only did Tesla divert staff, it also fired solar executives. Bloomberg reported that Musk dismissed both the head of Tesla Energy, R.J. Johnson, and Ryan Nungesser, the director of operations at Tesla's Buffalo factory, where the tiles are made. And now, the focus is on Model Y production at two new gigafactories in Texas and Berlin. Even with so much on its plate, Tesla likely won't give up on its solar ambitions because it's a way to show the world that it's more than a car company, but one that intends to lead the transition to clean energy. And I hope you agree that's the future we want. Solar is an integral part of its clean energy ecosystem. The energy produced from the roof is stored in the Tesla Powerwall, which can power your home during an outage or charge your electric car. So it's, a three, it's an obvious three-part solution. Except two parts are still missing. Not only the solar tiles, but also Powerwall production has lagged behind, which Musk blames on chip shortages due to the pandemic. Tesla acknowledges its solar division has work to do. It wrote in its fourth quarter earnings report that it plans on making further cost improvements. It appears to be moving in that direction. 
Tesla has launched an updated solar roof tile with a 23% higher power capacity without increasing the size of the tile, according to a spec sheet obtained by Electric. So fewer solar tiles would be needed since each roof uses a mix of tiles, some with and some without solar cells, although they all look the same. Fewer solar tiles means fewer electrical connections, which can bring down the cost. Although Tesla's solar roofs have yet to take off, Musk says he's confident it will happen. I think it will not be long before Tesla is by far the market leader in solar. So I've been looking for an exciting investment for 2022, and a revolutionary platform offers one that really caught my eye, Masterworks.io. Masterworks gives you the chance to invest in famous paintings by Picasso, Monet, and Banksy by buying shares in their artworks. Why art? Art has outpaced the S&P 500 from 1995 to 2021 and has almost no correlation with stocks. Is it legit? Yes, it is. Masterworks is the first company to offer paintings filled with the Securities and Exchange Commission as public offerings. Is anyone else doing it? Yes, they are. Over 300,000 investors have already signed up. One of their latest offerings by Banksy sold out in under three hours. Masterworks flipped another painting by the famous street artist for a 32% return in 2020. And George Kondo's Staring Into Space gave investors a 31% return last year. There's a lot of demand to invest in art and often a waiting list, but you can get priority access by heading to my custom link in the description, which also supports this channel. Thanks for watching. For News Think, I'm Cindy Palm.